Did you know that changes in your skin can be one of the first warning signs of diabetes? Many people don't realize the connection between your skin and diabetes. We'll break down these early indicators, explain what to look out for, and how recognizing these signs can help you manage your health better. How diabetes affects the skin Diabetes is a condition that impacts nearly every part of the body, and yes, that includes your skin. Elevated blood sugar levels can lead to skin problems, some of which can be seen as early signs of diabetes. Whether you have type 1 or type 2 diabetes, noticing these changes early could help in early diagnosis and prevent complications later. Acanthosis nigricans, a dark warning. Have you noticed dark, velvety patches on the back of your neck, armpits, or groin? This condition, called acanthosis nigricans, could be an early warning of high blood sugar levels. These patches are not just a cosmetic issue, they're often a red flag for diabetes. If you see these on your skin, it's important to consult a doctor. Early detection could save you from more serious health problems. Skin tags, harmless or a sign? Many of us have skin tags, those little growths on areas like the neck, eyelids, or armpits. But did you know that numerous skin tags, especially when accompanied by darker skin, can be linked to high blood glucose levels? In people with diabetes, these skin tags are more frequent and can signal underlying health issues. Necrobiosis lipoidica, hard patches of skin necrobiosis lipoidica, a condition where yellow, reddish, or brown patches develop on the skin. These bumps may start small, looking like a pimple, but they grow into patches of hard, swollen skin. What's more, these patches may also be itchy and painful. If you see these signs, particularly on your shins, you should get tested for diabetes. It's essential to control your blood sugar to manage this condition. Diabetic dermopathy, shin spots a lesser-known skin condition linked to diabetes as diabetic dermopathy, often referred to as shin spots. These spots resemble age spots but have a different cause, they are the result of changes in the blood vessels due to long-term high blood sugar. Although they are typically harmless and painless, they can stay on your skin for years. Blisters, skin hardening, and infections Some people with diabetes may notice blisters appearing out of nowhere, typically on the hands, feet, legs, or forearms. Unlike blisters caused by burns, these are painless but should still be taken seriously. Additionally, people with type 1 diabetes may experience something called digital sclerosis, where the skin on the hands, fingers, and sometimes the toes becomes thick and waxy. This condition can limit movement and make daily activities difficult. If this happens to you, managing your blood sugar and moisturizing regularly can help alleviate symptoms. Frequent infections and wound healing issues Lastly, one of the more serious skin-related issues in diabetics is the increased frequency of bacterial and fungal infections. These often occur in warm, moist areas like under the breasts, between fingers and toes, or in the groin. Infections such as jock itch, athlete's foot, or vaginal yeast infections are all more common in people with diabetes. More concerning is the issue of poor wound healing. Long-term high blood sugar can damage your nerves and blood vessels, leading to poor circulation. This means even minor cuts or sores, especially on the feet, can turn into serious diabetic ulcers if not treated early. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon for more informative content. So, what should you do if you spot any of these changes on your skin? First, don't panic. These signs don't automatically mean you have diabetes, but they are a strong indication to get tested especially if you have other risk factors like obesity, a family history of diabetes, or if you lead a sedentary lifestyle.
dark patches of skin, acanthosis nigricans, numerous skin tags yellowish, hard skin patches blisters or frequent infections slow healing wounds, particularly on the feet if you're over 40 or in a high-risk group. Regular blood sugar tests could help catch diabetes early and prevent long-term complications. This video is for information and education purpose only. Please note that while skin changes can be linked to diabetes, they are not always a definitive diagnosis. Always consult your healthcare provider for a proper assessment and testing.